I'm gonna start recording. Oh shit, there's someone behind us. That's really close. Oh, there's a gunner. Whoa. <clears throat> Someone took over the 50 cal? Uh, there's another 50. Oh, shit. Is it still on the road? Yeah. What? It just like blocked all my shots or some shit. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah, I wish like we had more conventional war scenarios instead of just oh shoot this faggot with like no arm. Mm, yeah. It's At least if you taking command. Even fighting SOCOM would be like less boring than this. Think I see it? I'm trying to blow it up. Should I? I could try I have the eighty four. I got the M twenty seven. There you go. <clears throat> I mean, never sent you two. I sort of gotta have fucking dyslexia or some shit. Alright. Oh, I see contacts bearing 130 on the hill. Yeah. They're kind of far. Let's push up on them. Oh. They're dead. You're down? No, they are dead. There was a couple oh. of stragglers I got. Yeah, still out of stragglers. They fell back to the base. Contact, you want me to drive that? Uh, no need. I'll just try and position it a bit further. Oh. Ah, oh, these guys are using AKs. Someone on the road. I'm 40. What a sucker. Alright, let's try pushing up. This thing still has fuel. Yeah, just using up the last three rounds. Alright, might as well. Cause God forbid though. you reload halfway. Yeah, why can't you reload? It's like so weird. Oh. It's already. Right right. What the hell? You just shot him in like the neck and it did nothing. It's all like a blood splatter. Oh, that's a lot of them. Reloading. You want to continue on foot? Yeah, why not? Uh, maybe we should use the 50. Why do they... Aren't they supposed to be running towards cover, not just standing still? On 
Hesco. Saka tried to hide behind a bush. Yeah. It's in the tent. Oh, son of the lavon! Tout le feu! I'm speaking French because I couldn't change my voice. Wait, these guys are wearing AAF uniforms. This Altis Lizard. I didn't know that Lizard is actually a uh, Greek camel. I mean, like, Lizard is like one of those uh, things that you hear about but you don't actually think much of. How much ammo do What's you have next? left? We have to kill Acolyte. Which is... I have six to... full magazines. It's more than enough. Hmm. I have... 12 in my gun. And 5 spare. Even the Daisy, uh... Even the fucking Daisy ports of the AKS-74U looks better than the one in our... In our chest? Yeah. The AKS and for you and RHS look models like dark in like AK so, uh, and RHS are just really dark. Like the, especially the AKS 74 UN. It's just black. Yeah, it just looks like someone lacquered it or some shit. It really does. It's really stupid. I just want them to like add in the uh the SPP and the one OP fifty for the machine guns. And with those optics? But like, yeah, the SPP is the 1P77 for the PKP and the PKMN. It's know, a 4 times scope. About? What, you mean the donkey dog? Uh, no, it's the, it's a scope for the PKM. But like, I think Black Matter is only ever, is only interested in modeling the sniper scope. Which we don't exactly have a shortage of. Black metal, but them. Like that's what uh, G. Felton told me when he, when we were playing on Livonia together. Oh yeah, what does Graham do again? He's a modeler, right? Yeah. How do you pronounce it? Graham, is it? Graham. Oh, Graham. Whoa, 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 uh, I am injured. I have no idea where that guy went. I just like ran him over and he just sort of disappeared. So be it. Wanna clear this place up? Yeah. This place is causing us. Is this the. Is this where we're supposed to be? No. It's our station, uh, Mike 26. It's. Just another place. We'll just like wrecky this place and see if there's like any more people to look out for. Whoa, wrecky. Okay. There are like a bunch of watchtowers to uh to the south. Three watchtowers with like patrols. Uh yeah, those oh, patrols think, are moving. I think towards these us. guys look mean. Oh shit. Stop shooting at rabbits, faggot. Those aren't rabbits, they shoot at me. You think rabbits would hold guns and shoot people?
These guys are all using AKs. <coughs> Dead. I don't know what kind of pussy ass country you go to where the rabbits do not have rifles. You're trying to hit the guy on the watchtower? Yeah. But I'm having aiming dead zone, so it's a bit of a little bitch. <laughs> he just, dude, he did one of those things where, like, you know, where you shoot people in your ledges and they just, like, willingly fall off? He just did that. Yeah, he just flopped. I think they're all dead, right? There's still another two more watchtowers. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, I didn't know there was a watchtower over there. Looks like it was like hidden from my sight. Oh, I got him in one shot. Is he dead? No, he's still very standing. Uh, Are you for real, dumbass? <laughs> he just bailed out. Oh, he's still alive. He broke his legs though. Maybe we should have brought magnified optics. Contact. He came from the right. entrance we came from. Come on, Yin, get him! There's one more near the Hesco. Nice. He should have continued firing. Yeah, why did he just stop? He's like, oh my brother. <laughs> Thank you. I noticed that the uh, pouches on my IOTV are like slanted. I hate like that stupid uh, chevron shape thing on the front of the IOTV. Like, what the fuck is that for? Chevron shaped thing? Yeah, on the top of the IOTV. Okay, let's get back uh, the stop shooting at me! Uh. For enemy! This is not a very solid cover. Where the fuck are they? Can you tell me the bearing? Hang on, I think I've got them both. Well, they're not returning fire, so I guess you did. Yeah, I'm more near the watchtowers, near the road of the watchtowers. Mm. They are all camping in the bushes. You want to move on foot or? They are all on foot. No, I mean you and me. Oh yeah, let's do that. I'm on your ass. What's your mad count? Ying? Huh? What's your mad count? Uh, five. Got four. You think we can climb Three. over this? Yep. Climbs over Bob Fire. <laughs> You're like a boss, bro. <laughs> this is so baller. This is like real 2035 technology that I want to see. Soldat, 200 meters devant. It's the most gamer. I'm gonna climb over this barbed wire. Yeah. Bitch. I thought we were fighting the AAF. No, oh, they're FIA.
For some reason, the FIA in this game have. Oh, oh shit, that's fifth guy. Not anymore. Reloading. Foo enemy. Damn, dropped magazines. Oh, you brought PMAX. Yeah. I hate how bulletproof like these machine guns are and how wide their hitboxes can be. Hmm. It's a good thing we didn't just barrage straight into this fucking place. I do think that maybe like magazines are a lot more like uh armored than you than we give them credit. I mean like Belt A was literally called an armored bra. I mean, if you shoot ammo, it would explode, wouldn't it? It depends on the type of ammo, I guess. Like, if it worked really well for, like, the Spetsnaz grew back in Afghanistan, I guess, you could. Aren't they just using, like, corrosive ammo or something? Using what? Corrosive ammo. Uh, they were just using, like, regular steel core. Like, your PS and GS. Isn't... PS, like, um, the primer itself is corrosive, isn't it? Or is it like the gunpowder? Uh, I'm not too sure. Maybe, maybe it might be both because, like, but then again, like, the AKs have a uh, chrome lined barrel, so they don't exactly worry that much about corrosion in the first. Hmm. Unless you're a Yugo, Yugos believe in not having chrome lined barrels, so their barrels, like, die after one match. Yeah, I watched a video of like um, some guy testing like corrosive gunpowder on like just untreated steel and like black smoke uh, like regular black powder and smokeless modern gunpowder and like after like what two days the um, corrosive gunpowder rusted the entire plate. That's pretty cool. Well, not the entire plate, but it was like really fucking bad. Man, isn't this a good track? It makes me feel all healthy and shit. <laughs> yeah, this grass looks good. It's just regular grass. I, I like the grass. You like grass so much, why do you eat it, huh? I just like seeing like lush greenery instead of fucking arid environment. I mean, this is sort of arid as well. Yeah, it's kind of it's like semi-arid, but like it's a lot better looking than like pure arid. Yeah, I like this more than like Altus has a lot of fucking arid and also greenery. Like it's more green. I don't understand all those like fuckers who insist on playing only uh Pakistan or like some stupid uh Middle Eastern desert. Yeah, like, I see a smoke plume. I want to play Middle Eastern like winter yeah, yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, come back here. You have a binoc? No, I don't think so. Oh, I do. Okay. Uh, look at that smoke plume. You see that? That's a fucking base. That's our position. Huh. It's yeah, I can see patrols too. It's pretty uh. Warm down for a base. Maybe that's why they chose it as a base. If they wanted it to be in Cognito, where the fuck did they put a smoke plume? I could notice that shit from a mile away. Alright, well at least we know that's our target. Thought it was deeper down inside the uh, valleys and stuff. And stuff. Anyway, what are you talking about again? Pakistan? It's like that stupid uh desert wank. Oh. Like I guess once in a while it's fine, like maybe a map like Kujari or some shit, but like everyone just ever wants to take uh pictures of like some stupid dev grew LARP in the middle of like some desert. Yeah. Which is fucking gay. It's like the milfag equivalent of like normies. 
Like, <laughs> if I want to roleplay as US Special Operations, I'd rather roleplay as someone who doesn't fuck up their mission. <laughs> so that's why we're dressed up as AAF, because we fuck up Like, fuck Dev Crew. Let's be like Green Berets and like die in Nigeria or some shit. <laughs> I'm so sad. Wasn't that in Somalia? There was like the Rangers in oh, Somalia, yeah, that was, that's right. that was in Nigeria, then there's like yeah. the one in Nigeria. How many people The Nigerian died? one was like semi arid as well. <laughs> I'm not sure, like maybe like four or five or some shit. I remember watching the video of like a Nals. Like an. Uh. An. Analysis? Analysis? Yeah, I think I, I think I know which video you're talking about. Yeah. It was the one that gave like the top down view and it's like, oh, this guy died here, this guy died there. I wonder if there's there was, anybody on and then the, the And then one of them like ran into a bunch of bushes and like fucking hold up himself in there until he died. <laughs> yeah, and there's two contacts inside of the blown up fucking tower thing. Alright. It sure would be nice if we brought fucking magnified optics, but instead I brought an MRS. It's part of the challenge, I guess. Plus, yeah. we aren't doing too shabbily on this map. Yeah, it's, it's not, not too shabby. I mean, part of the reason why is because he shot all the fucking 50 cows before they shot us. There's also like a map called Clef Gun, which is mountainous and stuff, which looks kind of nice, honestly. Oh, I totally forgot I had a pistol. Have you ever like uh tried the map clef gun before? No, I don't really try maps out that much. Yeah, it's like a very mountainous uh map with like occasional snowy patches and shit, which is kinda nice, but from a distance the mountains they look like they they have pimples because of how the trees are red. I was about to say. How far away do you figure that is? Five hundred meters? Four hundred? Hmm. I can't really gauge distances very well. Maybe like, uh, yeah, maybe five hundred would be a good estimate. Maybe four or five hundred. It'd be, be like, if we wanted to try and engage them from here, it'd be better if we engage them with iron sights because at least we can zero those in. Okay, there's. Uh, okay, there's a guy in a watchtower. Yeah. And another guy in what used to be a watchtower. Is that one or two? Oh yeah, yeah like one. two. So there's two inside of that big blown up watchtower. There's a couple of patrols. I don't know where the fuck they went, but... Oh, this is like the arid part. Mm. <laughs> I figure this place would be way greener in the spring, cause like this looks like summer. I could show the watchtower fact. You ready? Mm, not really. I'll try and find a better position so that I can open fire on those dudes inside of the um bigger watchtower. Oh, there's three of them inside of there. Shit. Okay, that's like 400 meters, right? Uh, maybe three or 400. I'll gauge for 400. Um... Hmm. Ready on your mark? Oh, just fired a shot. Yep, that's 400 meters. Maneuver warfare! Huh, this works. Oh, 
now it's like 500. Are you using irons or? No, I'm using a red dot. That's one down. Was it too bad? Two more. They're behind the bushes. Yep. Mm, they're behind the hill now. All right. Well, they're two below that. Busted ass watchtower on the big one. I mean, let's try and push up on that. The way that AI perceives uh, perceives your camouflage is very simplistic. It's just a matter of like, oh, you're wearing a camel. I guess oh, you shit, have I limited. I, I guess you have less visibility. Oh, I guess I wasn't him. I just saw some dude in like an officer's uniform. There are like some scripts that change it such that uh, how the AI perceives you also depends on whether you are standing still or whether you are behind cover, which whether you are in concealment, which is kind of. Where's that coming from? The smoke blue. Oh yeah, I see him. Officier, 200 meters sur la gauche. Enemy. The fuck, that guy's like a scab boss, he just took three shots. He's wearing armor, I guess. Let's go check him out. He better be wearing armor. Oh. No, don't, don't quit now. Huh? I didn't even Let get, me like, confirm my fucking kill. <laughs> no! 